Hey everybody! I'm doing a video today that is something that everyone keeps asking me about, something that is very true to my heart. The genres of electronic music. Um, I hate R&B and hip hop, okay? That's another video, but like, everyone's always like, that loves that kind of genre, they're always like, oh, but electronic music, everything's the same in electronic music, like, everything sounds the same, and I'm like, you obviously don't know what electronic music is because there is so many different genres within that genre that you can't say it's all the same because it is not all the same stuff. Then you would know I do a thing called club chat where I talk about my clubs and all of them, all the places that I go to and the majority of them, let's not lie, are electronic places and electronic clubs. And I guess it's because it's the only kind of music that I really passionately enjoy and therefore I have a lot of information in my brain that I can let you guys know about if you don't really know about what electronic music is or all the different subgenres. I'm going to go through them and talk a little bit about them. So let's just start from where I think it began. <laughs> I think really what, well, the music I started enjoying was the 80s, I think. 80s was definitely that time period that was the first time period that electronic music started and getting on the actual dance scene and people used to actually go out clubbing to listen to it. The main one that started it all was the dance genre, so dance music. Dance music's that typical club, you know, like, <laughs> you know what I mean, like that type of music. I get it, can be very samey, but personally I love it. <laughs> Just, I guess, I get into it so much and I'm like, yeah, original electronic genre would be dance. And then from then, you got stuff like the 90s, which became into, like, trance. 90s <laughs> crazy dance music, which was literally also just sound. And so for all of those people, that's what was huge. Like, in the 90s, that's what, why it was so huge, because there was a huge rave culture and it was amazing. Everyone ex started experimenting more with it. You've got the 90s dance and you've got 80s. 80s dance is very different. If you look it up, you'll see it's more poppy almost and a lot more vocals. 90s doesn't really have any vocals. I personally, growing up in the 90s, love that 90s trance music and it is very kind of trippy. <laughs> so then after that, 90s, it became this point where electronic music kind of, kind of didn't stop, but it became very like Euro poppy. So early 2000s dance music was starting to experiment with dubstep and drum and bass. That was a huge one. Dubstep only kind of came in around Skrillex's times. Suddenly, this this band, which everyone or band artists, DJs, I don't really know what to call them, um, Pendulum came out. This is when I feel like. I started getting into dubstep. What dubstep is, is literally just, you know, that big drops, like have massive drops. And I know it's not for everyone. I know people have some problem with it, but I love it. And I think it's great. If you want to have a, go have a party, you know, it's not all the same as well. So you can't say that about dubstep. It just made me want to dance. And I was like, what is this? I find rock and dubstep very, very similar, which is something not many people really talk about, I just find them they are very similar because of the drops and I think I've, listen, I've listened to a lot of Prodigy which is a lot of rock and electronic kind of combined. I want a headbang to both of those so just saying. After that I would only listen to dubstep for many many years, I think four years or something um, and then I started listening to House and I think I started getting into that in about 2013. It shouldn't be all the same. If you're listening to good house music, it shouldn't be. It should have some really good drops and really good beats that make you want to dance. Um, my favourite genre now is Deep House, so Oliver Heldon's kind of beat, um, Chami as well, that's another big one. Deep House I think is the newest electronic genre. There's some really weird alternative music that's coming out in electronic music which is a bit strange, it literally is like plates banging and like weird beats like <laughs> Yeah, so recapping, we have quite a few things going on in electronic music. 80s electronic typical music, 90s house trance, which are two separate things. One's very trippy, one's just like normal house music which we listen to today. And then you have drum and bass, then you have dubstep, then you have your deep house and house music. Yeah, I hope this was useful in some way or another. Ask me any questions if you need 
about this genre or anything down below and please subscribe let me know if you want me to make any other videos about electronic music no thanks guys for watching bye